Hey guys, it's Validities here, coming at you from Booty Bay. You're probably wondering why there's two big ships just sitting right here in the port. That's because I phased this just so I can get the Bloodsail Admiral title and the hat which I'm going to use for my transmog to complete my Red Pirate set. So this is just going to guide you through how to get the rep as quickly as possible without dying at all, hopefully. <laughs> as long as you're not an idiot. So, uh, I'll just get to it. Alright, so what I do is, I start here, I kill this guy quickly because he gives a nice amount there. And the bruiser, but he doesn't, bruisers don't give anything in this phase. Because there's just so many of them and they're so easy to kill, they're just one hits. Otherwise it would be too easy to get the rep. And then this guy gives the most rep, he is Baron, he's the... He's the leader of Booty Bay, and he gives 30 rep, which is really good. And I come in here, kill this guy really quick, just with an arcane explosion. Jump down here, and kill these guys here, because they're in a big group. You know, I don't bother killing the small single guys running around that give 6, but I'll kill this guy here, just because he's just in my way. If you kill one of these people, they will, the bruises will aggro you at high level no matter what. But yeah. Then I come over here, and then these people give quite a lot. And when you re reach unfriendly, the, um, the wargans here stop attacking you. But don't worry if you do kill any of them, because they don't, they don't, you know, decrease your rep with the Buchanan's. So at the best, this is the best place here to gain rep in this spot here. Because there's just so many people and they all give quite a good amount. So you just AOE the crap out of that until they all die. Yep. Yeah, he's got 17 drugs. Shoot him with that. Yep. And then after that, one of the best places to get rep here is just from the auction house over here where you're killing these goblin guys. These guys are really annoying though because they do tend to run around the outside over here, if you can see the cursor there, which they're trying to do there, but yeah, and then they run through these boxes and you can't really get at them, and then you can't leave combat unless you have a fade ability like I do, but yeah, and that's pretty much the route you take to go around, and by the time you get back to this guy, they're pretty much all spawned back, so you kill them. The guys in the uh, goblin auction house over here, or whatever that is, they tend to spawn back a lot slower, and there's one guy that always spawns back really fast. And then these guys over here, there's usually two or three. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Now I'll show you where to start the quest chain to get to this phase, and then you'll be all good to get your own Blood Sail Admiral title and the Transmogable Hat. So yeah, this is where the quest chain starts to get into the phase that I was showing you in Booty Bay. Well, the quest starts right here in the Cape of Stranglethorn, right where I am now. And it starts from this little bottle here, which doesn't show up with the question mark on the map, so you have to you have to be lucky to find it if you didn't already know where it was. And when you hover over it, it'll give you an exclamation mark. It's not giving me one, because I've already done it, like, possibly like an hour or two ago. And, yeah. So after you get that, it'll take you to a woman... A troll woman, I think she is, and right here on Jaguro Isle or something, and that will lead you onto the quest in the Riptide here for the Blood Sail, which will eventually, after quite a while, take you to the Booty, booty, booty Bay, yeah, Booty Bay, and that's where the phase will begin, and that's where you can grind rep. I'll also show you a place where you can just grind it straight away without having to do any starter quests or anything right now. So this is the other place I was talking about. This is Faldir's Cove. It's in Arathi Highlands. And it's just down here. It's quite easy to get to if you just fly from Iron Forge or something. The only downside to this area is it is much slower rep rate than going to Booty Bay when it's phased. Because there isn't that much to kill. There's this guy, Shakes of Brain. And he gives you 25 if I recall. Yeah, oh, six, that's even worse. Yeah, so they don't actually give you that much. 
Oh, she uh, first mate gives you a uh, 30. So that's actually quite good for her, but that is not much overall, and the spawn rate is much lower. The spawn rate on Shakespeare Breen is really quick, so he's already spawned on me then. But that 6 right there from just that turn around there is still much lower than AOing them down in Booty Bay. This guy, for some reason, you can't actually kill. I'm not sure why. I mean, he's aggressive to you, but he can't. Att he's not attacking me, and he can't be attacked. But yeah, and there's not that many people on the ship. I think there's one person inside. So, all in all, it's a good area if you can't be stuffed to do the quests. But yeah, it's much less effective than Booty Bay. Okay. Hey guys, it's Bolivies here. Um. Well, thanks for watching. I'm just going to show this last clip, showing you what the final efforts will look like after all your hard work. I'll be uploading some more videos soon, so hopefully you can tune in for them, and I'll see you guys later.